Hi everyone, this is Peter2776 back. I'm reporting back with the Acer A500 ice cream sandwich update, which finally came through this morning. I'm in Toronto, and um, it is May 14th. I got the update at 8.30 in the morning. I must admit I was getting very, very impatient. Uh, the update was due back on April the 27th, and actually it even bothered me more that some people got it earlier, but what can we do? I mean, uh, it took its time to get here, but I must say it was worth the wait. Now, I was actually anticipating it to come this weekend, so what I did on the, on Friday was I did a complete factory reset, um, only because I've been hearing people or issues on, on forums that people had with their applications either not working or crashing, and I figured, you know what, maybe there was some caches to clear, maybe if we just get a fresh start with a brand new update, everything will run better, and that is that seems to be the case so far. I've been running it and playing with it for the past two hours. Everything on this tablet works. All the apps, all the games, everything. And to make things even better, it is buttery smooth. Every transition is incredibly fast. There's no lag whatsoever. Um, going into the apps and going through the widgets, I mean, it's super quick. Super, super quick. And it's just light years ahead of uh, Honeycomb, in my opinion, uh, in terms of speed, because Honeycomb, especially on the app tray, was very, very choppy. So, um, nice transitions, nice speed. Uh, good job by Acer. I mean, there's no, there's very little bloatware on this one, except for the the uh, Acer apps that were already pre-installed when I first got the tablet, but nothing new has been added. Uh, there's no Acer ring, but you know what? I've had that on the uh, A200, which I got my parents, and I actually disabled it. They kept touching it by accident. It doesn't really do much. I mean, bookmarks I've got right on my home page. The screenshot you can now do with the home and the home button and the, um, or sorry, the power button and the volume up. So you don't really need the ring. I mean, it's there for cosmetic reasons, in my opinion. But you know, if you like it, great. It's not going to come to the A500, from what I understand. But it's not the end of the world. Uh, what I really wanted was just you know, a faster tablet, and that's what I got. It feels like a brand new tablet. Everything just opens super quick. Um, you know, you can kill your apps, the ICS way. It's just it's just perfect. So uh, hopefully there's no more delays for anyone else out there who's still waiting for it. Uh, I know that there's a big part of the world that still hasn't gotten it. Um, it's been going out in batches, but... I am hoping that if I got it today, um, a lot more got it, and we'll probably have it by the end of the week at the latest. So um, I can't really do too much more of a review on ICS. I've done that on previous videos that I have with my HP touchpad and with the Acer um, A500, or sorry, A200 tablet that I have. So just enjoy for everybody who has gotten it, and for anyone who hasn't, uh, just be patient. Once you do get it, um, it's going to feel like a brand new tablet. and you're just going to be over overjoyed by the fact that it's finally there and that it's all working perfectly. Um, if you have any questions, comments, please leave them behind. Uh, I'll get back to you. Um, one other thing I will add, uh, on top of the fact that it's um, super quick on the transitions with regular wallpapers, with live wallpapers, it's running great as well. And live wallpapers was a big issue with uh, Honeycomb. Um, once I had them on, it would lag completely but it runs just as smooth as if I had a regular wallpaper so I'm very happy to report that live wallpapers for the most part should be working properly and um, yeah I mean again if you have any questions let me know it's Peter2776 and I give this Acer A500 ice cream sandwich update a two thumbs up